I'm up pretty early this Sunday. So I'm just walking over to church. It's a uh, it's pretty close to me, this church, and it has a Charmander, so, like, yeah, I might as well go get a Charmander while I'm up, and, uh, yeah, pretty decent. Then I went to sleep for most of the day. In the afternoon, got a Amazon package, but it has to do with the day 600 episode. So, not really gonna show you exactly what it is, but there's a little teaser. Yeah, washed some dishes, and um, when it's uh, about midnight, I'm heading out for a bike ride. I'm gonna go to Tommy Thompson Park to watch the Perseid Meteor Shower. It's supposed to be its prime tonight. Maybe yesterday would have been as good as well. And uh, yeah. About 1 a.m. is when the moon is supposed to set, so it should be pretty dark. And uh, Tommy Thompson Park doesn't have any lights, and it's about as far away from the city I, I think I can get without having to go, like, really far. So it'll be dark. And, uh, yeah, it was dark. I'm walking through the park, and I'm like, oh my god, this is kind of creepy. I thought I saw someone in the distance here. I was like, nah, it's probably just a thing. And when I got closer, it was a person. And I was like, oh my god, why is there just a guy walking around here without any lights on? I honestly didn't think I was going to get as spooked as I was just walking through the park. So maybe it's because I had my headlamp on. There's lots of shadows of from the bushes and stuff. And, uh, I don't know. I, I feel like I would hear people's voices and stuff. Like, I definitely saw someone with a campfire or something. Now I'm crossing this uh, bridge. And I can hear, like, random splashes and stuff occasionally. It's kind of like, oh god. But uh, to the right, you can see the city. It's a nice view. Yeah, I used to GoPro a bit, but it's pretty terrible at night, so you can't really see anything. Anyways, I think I'm close to the lighthouse now, the end of Tommy Thompson. Um, like looking around at the ground where it's all gravelly now. And uh, it's still pretty bright here, like uh wasn't as dark as I thought it was going to be. Maybe my eyes are starting to adjust. And there's a fair amount of clouds in the sky. Of course, my camera's not good enough to capture any of the meteors. So here's some, just like, footage from YouTube. But yeah, I saw about five, like, good bright meteor meteors. And that was like, I don't know, it's cool. It's been a while since I've just laid on the ground and, like, looked up at the stars. Now I'm leaving the park, and uh, at the end, like where I was like lying around, there were other people, I could hear them, but they left, and I wasn't sure if there was other people around. Like I could see silhouettes of something, it looked like maybe it was people just like sitting around, but not moving or making any sound, so I was pretty creeped out. Yeah, it's creepy. Ah, man. And then, uh, so yeah, on the way back, going over that bridge again, I hear a splash in the water, and I'm like, oh my god. I'm always, like, I always think about, like, there could be a monster in this water. And I think about things like giant squids that are real, and just, like, I, I hate it. Like, ugh, it's sending chills down my spine thinking about it. Like, what if something did just come out of the water and was just like, Ugh. God. So, yeah, I get kind of freaked out and I'm like, I gotta cross this bridge right now. <laughs> and when I get closer to the other edge of the bridge, 
I hear now they like splash in the water but from that side and I'm like oh my god why is there gotta be so many things in this water <laughs> but uh yeah everything was fine ah <sighs> now I'm back out the uh near the entrance to the park and yeah not far from street lights where things aren't spooky oh man for whatever reason down at the portlands it really smelled like that smelly tofu which is to say it smelled like literal shit it was awful but yeah now I'm just biking home and uh yeah that was pretty much it for today <laughs>